What is it like to be a little person? You about to find out. So this morning, as every morning, I got up and I started brushing my teeth. And what is that that you ask? Thank you for asking. Yes, that is me on my tippy toes. Leave it alone. What about when a little person is hungry? Here are the different variations of what it takes for a little person to obtain a bowl from the top shelf. Variation number one. My sciatic nerve is acting up. I can't be doing that. Variation number two. <laughs> Variation number three. I'll be right back. <sighs> Honey! What is it? <laughs> Come and look. I can reach the top shelf. Oh, sh <laughs> Barely. <laughs> <laughs> can you get me a bowl, yeah. too? Oh, my God. Huh? Can you get me a bowl too? Or maybe you're wondering, what is it like to go grocery shopping with a little person? When we grocery shopping, you need something from the bottom, I got them. You know what I'm saying? You need something from the top shelf, I don't ask for help. I do it all by myself because I don't need nobody else. You're not that hard, honey. I've always been this hard. That was the second to the top shelf. Let me tell you something, I've always been that hard. My whole life. Don't mess with my mic. It's my mic. It's my mic. This, this, this is not your mic. This is your mic. You speak into your mic. You're not that hard. The disrespect. Hush up! Yes, I am not making this up as I tell you all little people when they're grocery shopping, they bust out a freestyle every single time. I am not making this up. This is just simply facts. Why am I holding my mic like this? And here's what it's like for someone of my stature to walk through public. How about little people in vehicles? You don't have to worry about me getting my dirty feet on your seat, the dash, or the floorboard. Now when it comes to driving, I don't drive. I'm legally blind. Totally disregard the fact that my feet probably don't reach the pedals. I can get extensions. Leave it alone. Let's say that you want to befriend one of these little people. How, how, do you, how do you refer to a little person? What would you refer to a little person as? What would you say to them? There's two terms that you do not want to call your little person friend. You don't want to look at them and be like, hey, there's a dwarf. Hey, there's a midget. Look at him, his feet don't match his body. Listen, you're just gonna come off as an asshole. These are derogatory statements. But if you want to be a little person's friend, you refer to them as little people, or you just, you just treat them like a, like a normal person. It would be nice in public. <laughs> what if a little person wants to get swole, cuz? How does it look for a little person to go to a gym? Well, I'll have you know that they do not make workout equipment fit for little people that we do not fit. Either our hands don't reach or our damn feet don't reach. I'm not mad. What about what a little, what, what, what a little people, what a little people wear? Where you get all these fresh fits? Where, where'd you get all that damn swag? I got it out the youth section. You might have the same the size shirt I want. Please get off. That's my size. He won't give me the shirt. <laughs> I gotta find clothes that actually fit me. Well, the little boy section's up ahead, honey. Okay. What? What'd you just say to me? The little boy section. Keep walking. No, 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 no. Like the, you mean the young men section? I mean, if you want to call it that. See, see, I would have took anything else. You could have said youth section or even, or even, or even small people section, but you had to say little boy. What's little boy about this right here? Let, let me roll up the sleeves one time. <laughs> Does he look like little boy arms to you? These are some young men grown arms, okay. you know what I'm saying? Okay. Let's go. Is that Spider-Man? What size is that? It's a 3T, that wouldn't fit me. This ain't the young men's section. Or what about when little people, like we go outside, right? And, and it's a beautiful day. We're just like everybody else. And we're like, man, it's a beautiful day to go ride my bike. Honey. Huh? What are you doing? Nothing. You are supposed to be home 30 minutes ago. Well, honey, look at this thing. I'm pedaling as fast as I can. It don't go so fast. Well, you better be pedaling a little faster and hurry up and get home. Wait a minute, don't leave me, come get me! Come get me! Hey! <laughs> hey, hey! <laughs> hey, hey! And now apparently they got procedures for little people, you know what I'm saying? 
they can add like a few inches to your height. And this ain't just for little people. This is short people that want to be taller. This is for tall people that want to be even freaking taller. Do I want this procedure to happen to me? Hell no. Nobody would believe that I just grew overnight. Ain't nobody going to be like, well, that's awesome. They're going to laugh. They already laugh at my feet. Damn. It's like those people with that they get the plastic surgery. You know, when they get a little older, everybody's afraid to look old. They want to look young, so they get all that work done so they can look younger. No, you still look old. Now you just look old and tight. What about when a little person wants to be friendly? You know what I'm saying? Like, like put the arm around the shoulder type thing like, I got you. Well, I'm not speaking on behalf of all little people, but this is just a me thing. So put your arm around me. I got one shoulder. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So that shoulder over there, you gonna have to take care of that one. This one, I got you. Yeah. Hey, shake. Yeah. All right, let's go. Thank <laughs> you.